ash. Well, two decades later, an infamous murder case on the Central Coast is gaining national attention again. In 1998, Cal Poly student Rachel Newhouse disappeared while walking home from a bar in San Luis Obispo. Investigators were led to dead ends, but four months later, an eerily similar case appeared. Andrea Crawford was abducted from her apartment where she lived in Slo. A now-retired parole officer played a key role in cracking the case. Known sex offender Rex Krebs story about how he hurt his ribs didn't add up, raising some red flags. So I was looking at his arms and his hands and I just didn't see anything that would be consistent with a fall into the firewood. Krebs was arrested on a parole violation and Larry Hobson, a former San Luis Obispo County DA's investigator, interviewed Krebs about 10 times before DNA evidence linked him to the murders. Hobson says he still remembers nearly every detail of the intense investigation. Back in 1999, DNA didn't, <clears throat> didn't turn over in a matter of days. It took several weeks. And once that information came back as the blood found in his truck belonging to Rachel Newhouse, and then it became an interrogation at the San Luis Obispo Police Department. Krebs was convicted of the murders in 2001 and sentenced to death row. The now 52-year-old remains at San Quentin State Prison. Oxygen's true crime series, Buried in the Backyard, airing tomorrow at 7 p.m., highlights that investigation.